Hi, I'm Kelly Knuckleby, and I am an enrolled agent, and I'm the owner of Books by Kelly in Granite Falls, Minnesota, and we specialize in income tax returns for in-home family child care professionals. I discovered the concept of value pricing a couple years ago, and when I first heard about it, I was very excited because I had already been value pricing somewhat with my bookkeeping services but I learned more about it and so therefore I expanded and so now in my practice I looked at the services that are used most often by my clients and I bundled them into four separate base packages and then from there I talked to each of my individual clients to find out what their actual individual needs are to put those bundles into a value pricing format. So to start with, the first level is pretty basic services. It's just bookkeeping and payroll if the client happens to need payroll. The next level of service that they have to choose from would include the annual tax return and any informational tax returns like 1099s, sales and use tax, those types of items. The next package includes the first two packages and then addition, in addition, uh, written correspondence uh, representation and then one quarterly profit loss and tax forecast at the client's request. And then the final level starts with all of the previous mentioned in addition to all representation for that tax year. And then from that point I speak with each individual client and find out what their needs are. Some clients will pay extra because they want my cell phone number. Some clients will pay extra because they want to make sure that they're going to have an email answered within a 24-hour period. It just depends on what those individuals want. And so then that way I have the opportunity to start talking to my clients, find out what they're looking for. So it also adds value because I'm able to provide them with what's important to them, not with what's just important to me. I think my clients benefit from bundled services and value pricing because it provides them with the opportunity to let me know what it is they're looking for and what they need so that I can meet their needs. And it also gives them the opportunity to pay on a monthly basis instead of having large bills on an annual basis. And that seems to be the way that things are going with Netflix and Hulu and cell phones and everything else, the monthly services or the monthly payments are where the younger generation is looking. My firm benefits from offering value pricing because we no longer are bogged down by keeping track of the amount of time that is spent on each individual client or each individual activity. We still try to keep track of, in general, how long something takes so that when we go to offer the next year's contract, we know whether or not we're pricing things correctly. But in general, it, it keeps my staff from having to keep detailed timesheets. It also provides with monthly income instead of earning all of our income in the first four months of the year and trying to make it last for the rest of the year. And I think those are the two biggest things for the value pricing. On top of that, I think that the communication with my clients has increased tremendously.